Morning everyone, it's Simon Ward of the triathloncoach.com again with another of my time-saving strength and conditioning exercises. This morning I'm going to demonstrate to you a squat and press followed by a bent over row. So again we're working the push, exercise, the push muscles, the pull muscles and the leg muscles. I'm going to time this one to show you how long it takes me to complete 10 reps of each and then I'll prove to you that you can get these done in less than 5 or 10 minutes depending on how many sets you want. Ok, so I'm just going to step back over here, stay watching. So I'm going to have my feet slightly wider than my hips, have the weight stressing at my shoulders. And here we go with the time. So, one. Make sure it's a two part movement. Use the momentum from the legs to continue the push upwards. That's four, five, six. Hips down almost to knee height. Seven, eight, nine, ten. Now I'm going to turn sideways so you can see the back movement nice and straight, spine in neutral. One, two, three, four. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. That's fifty seconds. Okay, so it took me fifty seconds to do that. That's ten squats, ten presses, and ten bent over rows. Probably take about thirty seconds rest. So that's a minute and a half for a full set plus rest. So if you do four sets, you can get that done in probably five and a half to six minutes. Obviously, if you've got a bit longer, then do a few more sets. You can probably get half a dozen done in less than ten minutes. So full body workout, core involvement as well. Absolutely brilliant. No excuses. Just get the work done. Fit it in before you go out for a run, before you do a swim. Okay, thanks for watching. I'll see you again next time. This is Simon Ward from thetriathloncoach.com. Bye for now.